What's going on, everybody? Eddie Soundhead back once again here with Soundhead Entertainment. We are back in Wreckfest once again here today and back at Bristol as well because we have got something absolutely amazing to run for the very first time here today. Feast your eyes on the beautiful Gate Crasher with the 70s NASCAR skin packs on them. And I figured what better car to run at Bristol than that old blue and yellow number two that Dale Earnhardt won his first race in at Bristol, minus the sponsors, of course but very cool. This mod is unreleased, but we're gonna get to have fun with it today. Let's roll out. Oh, what a beautiful start right from the beginning of our day on the first run. Knock our clone up out of the way. The 15 does the dirty work for us. We got a wreck starting up here in front of us. We drive underneath the 92 and up on the safer barrier we go. Ricky Rudd getting just pummeled right from the start. He had a bad day already. Oh my goodness, we've got another big one forming here on the front stretch. Bunch of guys in the way. Gotta use AJ Ford as my brakes. And it didn't work very well. Then I got kind of mini pack there. We're still getting run over. Oh, gather it up. Nope, we're gonna get hit some more. Oh yeah, the hits keep coming and we're going over. We are flipping way down the track and we're landing on someone while being upside down. While they're upside down. It's like a double car centipede and the wreckage is still coming in. Ricky Rudd is still just being defaced out there on the racetrack. How was he still alive? No one knows. Oh, Newman, don't squeeze me. You did it anyway. I can't believe what I'm seeing. I can't believe this wreck up here. Oh, get out of the way, sir. I'm trying to get as low as I can. We're going to get through it. There's a couple of cars to beat their demise. Oh, somebody's stuck in the middle of the track and they're going four wide into the corner. These AI are nuts. They are insane. Can we get through it? We're going to get squeezed. No, I get run over. And we're going over. Oh, hang on to it. We've lost, but we're flipping back onto our wheels somehow. Oh, we just keep getting run over. We just keep getting trampled. My hopes and dreams have been dismantled and the friggin' ass packery coming in as well. And this guy's stuck on his side. I'll help out old BP. This has gone terribly bad. There's a cone check. Let's get out of here. Oh, we all held it together pretty well. I may have spoke too soon and I did. There they go. Three wide in the middle, the squeeze. I just sent Bobby Isaac straight to the wall and he gathered it up and so did I. And then they all pushed me to the corner. This is such great racing until you get shoved in the wall and there goes the 72. And it's a bad scene out here. The 19s get swallowed up, here they come. Oh my God, like a tidal wave. That was one of the scariest things I've ever seen in my life. Just a friggin' pile of cars coming at you. Is anybody going to knock me over? Anybody going to have the decency? Put me back on my wheels here, please. Thank you. And somebody just got launched. Oh, and more cars piling into him as he's flipping. Uh, and the gap is going to close for me as soon as I try to drive through it. This is an absolute scene right here, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my God. Could we please just let me gather it up? I just want to live. I just want to race. We are barely even two laps in. And I've already been just completely bombed out. Oh, Dave Marcus puts it in the wall. We're going to dump him. Oh, and somebody got ass bagged up here in front of us. And he's flipping and we hit him in midair. It was Ricky Rudd again. What a terrible day for Ricky. We're going to ass back the 43 across the line here and end our misery and suffering. Barrel check. Tim Rich. Oh, my God. That was brutal. That was head on and cars flipping and I'm getting hooked myself now. The 72 of Bobby Allison just right reared the life out of me and I'm still going around and right into the line of traffic. And just getting absolutely blown apart again. Look at the damage to this thing. Luckily, this thing's got some strength to it. We're going to test it out a little bit more though. Mr. Gatorade, man. Oh, he's going to get nailed. Oh, man, he got lucky. At least somebody's getting some good fortune out here. I keep getting killed. Holy slow cars and what an ass pack and it's all oh, it's all kicking off back there That's nasty Oh, got a couple of them in the wall here. Oh, we got one coming right across the track Ryan Newman wins and we all get destroyed in the back of the pack and Bobby Isaacs just running straight through me right into the line of racing cars What are we doing here, Bobby? My car is literally doing the spin a Rooney right now Damn it, Bobby. Oh, I'm going to get ass packed, and there it is. I literally lined myself up for it like a dummy. And I'm going to get nailed by every last car that comes by, I guess, too. That's great. Let's just let them all hit me. One health. 
Oh, yeah. Block the high side. Thanks, bud. Go ahead and throw that last block on me. I really needed that today. That might be the most... Dis what, 23rd? Oh, don't come down on me. They came down on me. We're three wide. I don't want to be three wide. We're not three wide anymore. All right, we're good. My clone, though, is trying to kill me, and he is. He's taking me out right now. I've been murdered by my clone. Flew over the racetrack. I'm lucky I didn't just get hit by, like, four or five cars right there. My clone wasn't so lucky, and you know what? Good. Get nailed, you idiot. Oh, the big one. It's the big one. We got the Gatorade cars flipping over again, and I tried to avoid it, and I somehow managed to wreck myself even worse than if I would have gone high. Beautifully done. That guy just got killed. I can hear another car coming. We're going to wait just a second, and we're going to go. All right. So that's how you avoid the death and carnage and destruction. But, uh, yeah, David Pierce, you go ahead and you have fun over there, buddy. Oh, man, that black car just getting tossed around back there. Poor guy. Man, this track is brutal. Oh, man. We're going to arc and break it. Everybody's got arc and breaks in this track, so why shouldn't we? We'll just drive up on top of the 43 car and send ourselves to the freaking infield. How's everybody doing? Race is over. I'm going to pack all these cars that are just chilling, and I'm taking the one car out, now. I am, I, are you kidding me? I'm having a stroke over here. I can't even believe what my eyes are showing me right now. And they're just having the slowest wreck of all time behind me. Don't mind them. We are trying to fit way too many cars into this first corner, guys. Especially when somebody's just literally going backwards. That was not recommended. Oh, the squeeze. How did we get through that? Two of them were coming for us. Heat seeking Terminators. Back at it again. My clone is still coming for me, too. He wants my head. Oh, they're going to do it. There they go. There they go. They're coming down the track. <laughs> Ease up. And back up the track they go. We're going to get through it. This has been a great avoidance run. Oh, there goes some more of them. Oh, into the wall hard and right back down in front of me for the packing. And then make it a double packing because I got one too. Dick Trickle, victorious yet again. We're actually going to finish in a relatively decent spot. We're going to come up on the podium. Oh, man, right to the outside wall. Ricky Rudd again. Having one of the worst days of any driver in recent memory. Just getting pummeled left, right, and center. And we're going around. Just the bad bounce, the bad touch. And here comes some more. And we have just stacked ourselves on top of Bobby Allison. Not what you want to see on the first lap. But it's becoming quite frequent to see here on the first lap at Bristol. This place is nuts. As we're going to give a push to another Alabama gang member, another Allison. Oh, the sends on the outside. You guys didn't even try. We're riding the safer barrier. Those guys just drove straight freaking through me. Oh, and here they all come. This is bad. Being old Matt Kent's coming back to NASCAR, and this is what he gets in return. Absolutely pummeled and left turtled on the track. What a sorry sight that is. Oh, here comes that ass back from Davey. Squeeze me. He just missed the full on pack, though. We're good. So many slow cars. Neil Bond's going to get held up by one. We'll sandwich him, and he comes back up and repays the favor to us. Oh, and he's turtled. He'll roll down the track, and when Matt Kenseth comes through and hits me again. Oh, man, Matt is back there. Everybody's gathering up. He'll kneel, trying to figure it out. We're going to get to the line before both of them. It's still going to be an absolutely pathetic finish, but a finish nonetheless, and we're going to pack lay him down right after the race is over oh cut it down to the bottom got through the gap that's beautiful we got one flipping two flipping up top and it's the big one. Oh my goodness it's the big one on the back stretch at bristol that looked bad oh we got carnage up here we got cars coming back up watch out don't do it you're squeezing oh and then you try to take me out you slime ball you bum these guys gonna wreck too they're trying and there they go into the wall we're gonna gain a few more spots here baby yes see if we can get one more here in the final corners give a little shot to bobby isaac we got dual bobby isaacs up here this is a problem there goes the 21 he's gone we lost one and that's becoming a pileup back there oh is it ever yes it is we finished third again but we caused a lot of havoc oh there they go 24 up on his side keep it off of me boys keep it up top keep it up top and they do but they all go bouncing around up in the air across the track all kinds of trouble behind us we get through it i'm gonna get bump drafted in the middle of the corner and the wreck is gonna happen in front of us as well the 24 and neil bonnet just cleans us out and there goes a bunch of cars flying behind us carnage and pieces flying everywhere 
Three wide into the corner is a brave one, boys. It's not gonna work. It's definitely not gonna work. We're gonna squeeze through the middle, though. Oh, we can't squeeze through the middle of that. Matt Kenseth just got us again. Is this the new rivalry? Matt hasn't even run an official race since his return, and he's already getting on my bad side as these guys are trying to wreck before this race finishes. And boy, are they achieving that goal. We get across the line. Nothing good, though. Only in ninth. But Matt Kenseth, we see you. Oh, here they come down again. Four wide. Drifting it on the apron. Bring it back up top. We lost all of our momentum. But we're still alive. They are trying as hard as they can to hook Ricky Rudd. And there they all go. Because they were trying. And then Ricky Rudd just gets Bobby Allison all kinds of sideways. And Ricky Rudd's coming for me, too. He's not going to be off the track. Ricky Rudd, what are you doing? Man, they're all coming for me right now. I'm getting knocked around. Disrespected. That was Neil Bonnet. Ricky Rudd and Bobby Allison still trying to wreck each other. Come on. Something's got to give here. Somebody is going to hit a wall at a high rate of speed. Oh, somebody's pulling up on the track. That leads to a pack. And it's going to be a roadblock. This is going to get interesting. I dump Bobby Allison. Ricky Rudd dumps me. And there we all go. All of us get destroyed. Oh, and then Kenseth comes through. They all got me. They all teamed up to get it. All of my foes. That was a quadruple whammy of rivals. Well, Davey Allison gets the dub. We come home to an absolutely abysmal, worthless 13th place finish. Oh, 72 trying to run my bumper off. We got him wrecking right here in front of us. And they were four wide in front of us for a moment up here. I was more worried about these guys. Somehow they were the ones that made it through. I don't understand that. But I don't understand many things that happen in this game. So here we are. Oh, I do understand ramming Bill Elliott. And the 24 goes flipping. And that is a barrel check to end all barrel checks. Oh, got him wrecking off the corner. And it's Ricky Rudd getting carried off the field. Oh, my goodness. Oh, got wrecking on the front stretch coming to the white flag. We might have a shot at this if some real drama breaks out. Oh, Ryan Newman's going to kill my momentum, though. No. No, we have a top four in our grasp. Could we get to that lead? I don't think we're going to have enough unless something really stupid happens right now. We're going to come home in fourth. You absolutely hate to see it. But hey. We survived, and that's something at this point. Oh, don't hook me, 15. Thank you. Oh, we got him getting hooked up here in front of us. There we go. Got him sideways in the middle of the track. Four wide in front of us, and they're dead. And Cecil Gordon is taking us right to the pileup, and now we're in it. We are deep within it. Land on the wheels, at least, but there's carnage all around us. Who would have thunk it? Who is shocked? Absolutely no one. But we carry on nonetheless. DJ Foy looks like it might come down to you with me, bud. This might be the last position we're capable of fighting for, and we put him in the wall. We just wipe him out of our way. We love to see it. Please don't come down. They're coming down. And there goes our race. Right from the get-go for not only me, but my clone. The sight of it is absolutely disgusting in every way. Oh, don't do it, Cecil Gordon, again. I have many questions, and most of them are why, and that is a pile up and a half. And then Mark Martin coming in with the pack. You are absolutely just sickened by the sight, and we are being thrown into the wreck by none other than our buddy Bobby Allison. Again, still trying to hook me. He is going to hook me. Here he goes. Mission accomplished yet, Bobby. You absolute waste. Get him out of here. Well, we've lost, so I guess he did accomplish his mission. Let's see. That looks like a fairly tame start until Bobby Allison gets lifted up on two wheels and partially spins me around, but we survive. Some others don't, including Bobby. He's flipping. Oh, poor Bobby and Cecil getting rid of a couple of menaces right from the start. Kicked in Mark Martin's back bumper, but they're wrecking in front of us. They're all going. The track is blocked. We're going to drive right through it. What? How is that possible? That was some of the best wreck avoidance we've ever had in the history of life. Oh, who is this wrecking up here all on their own and coming into my lane? Oh, it's BP. 
I'm sorry, BP. I tried to avoid you, but we had a vicious T-bone. Bobby Isaac has won. I've been had. And I'm sliding down on my side like a worthless chump. That was a sick little wheelie right there by Dave Marcus. And then we just get absolutely cream. Oh, if I get hit even more. And oh, you bet your butt I am too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Keep them coming, boys. Let's go. I'll just finish the race like this, I guess, till somebody carries me across the line. It's not like we're in the last freaking couple quarters or nothing. I just want to live and I'm stuck on my side. What an existence this is. There's no time to chill here at Bristol when you've got these maniacs in front of you. I mean, look at them going three wide, four wide. I don't even want to look back and see what's happening right now. I'm actually too frightened to see what abomination is waiting for us in the rear view. But I might not have a choice if David Pearson just drives right through me and I've been just absolutely bludgeoned to my demise. I went head first into that wall. That was one of the most brutal things I've ever seen. I can't even tell if I have all four wheels right now or not because my sheet metal is that far destroyed. I don't know. I can still drive those. So let's go. Oh, nice little Hawaiian car. That was my steed, my trusted steed for the gauntlet. And this is what it repays me with. We got a double stacked up here and Ricky Rudd has flipped again, the poor guy. Oh, bouncing off the wall, getting absolutely driven clean through like a drive through at your favorite fast food restaurant that isn't sponsoring me, but should be. And this is where we are now in dead last literally in dead last and i've been ass packed to smithereens again i've got 16 health points and we've got a hell of a crash happening right here in the 84 it's gonna stick the landing this car is uh it's pretty banged up but you know what you can't say we didn't finish because uh we did we finished in the absolute worst possible position but we finished and that's what matters oh this is gonna go up brilliant driving maneuvers being exhibited up here in front of us oh yeah there it is right there actually that's my favorite move that's called the wreck half the field yeah we break that one out every now and then it's a solid move solid solid move only the pros can do that one and, and this one as well where you just take bp a great man and throw him out of the race and then you just walk into a wall of cars and get cleaned out and there are cars. Matt Kenson just came across the screen like a fastball, and he's flipping up at the top of the track. And it's a pile of this has gone nuts. That went from zero to 100 so fast. What is this? Good. Bump draft to Dave Marcus at Bristol into the corner past BP. Oh, he's going to do it and squeeze in the gap as well. Don't you do it, AJ. Oh, he almost did it. I thought AJ Foyt was gonna come up and ruin my dreams, but he didn't do it. I'm shoving Dave Marcus into the wall as best I can. Coming off the corner, they got a couple of them wrecking for position. I'm gonna clean somebody out from the bottom. Ew, giggity, and we get fit. It is what it is, we still haven't got the dub. Oh, don't come down on me, there they go. Yep. Sir Isaac Newton's laws, they are uh, definitely correct. I have peer reviewed them here in Wreckfest and we can guarantee you that what goes up must come down. We have proven that as an absolute fact uh no apples required just a lot of stupid ai and here we go see case in point case in point get out of my face we got places to be this is absolutely atrocious pearson oh that's what you get oh and he's gonna take out aj Foyt in the process i put myself in the wall bobby isaac does too Oh, we got one flipping up in the court. Oh, don't you do it, Neil Bonnet. What are you doing? And Ricky Rudd just gets absolutely blasted right in the roof. Thankfully, that was a passenger side hit as I get packed while I'm on my side. No respect whatsoever. Poppy Isaac just rocking through the scene, spinning around. I'm going to put him in the wall just to get him on my way. And now I'm going to get sandwiched in between a slow car and I get dumped. That's a little bit of karma coming into play right there, if I had to guess. It strikes honorably, but swiftly. And it will get you. Can I get AJ Foyt at the line, though, to not finish last? Nope. Nope, I am the biggest loser yet again. You hate to see it. Oh, clone. Easy on the clone. Let me clear you, clone. Nice little bomb draft from David Pearson right there. Down the pack. You got a wrecking up here. 21's coming back up. And there are a bunch of them go flipping. We might have some Space Force candidates on that one. There were some guys going way up in the air. We're still getting rammed. Oh, they're still flipping back there. My oh my. Not a good way to start the race again. 
There's the man who caused this all the 21. I must I must finish ahead of you at least You caused all this pain barrel check get the barrels out of my face And we are gonna come across the line in a trash Weasley 18th, but we did cross the line Oh 15 almost got dumped by Bobby right off the start. That was almost Bobby on Bobby violence right there We can't be having that Oh, this you can't be having this in front of us either. Look at this mess. Oh my god. Here it comes. There it is Nowhere to go a hole does open up, but my god, it's a twister car spec there That was bad Oh Man, who's that Cecil Gordon up there getting launched in the air? Yes, it is and Ricky Rudd bounces off of him because of course he does Ricky Rudd's bad day Just keeps getting worse and I'm gonna ask back AJ Foyt and that's gonna kill any run I had left at catching these leaders because they're not that far away If I could just get up to them, but we are out of time off of four I might get Bobby Isaac and Newman here at the line, but that's not for position. So what good does it do me? I got hyped up for nothing. I'm sad now Come on. We got to get Tim Richmond losing it on the high side and we just clean him out Just got rid of him disposed of him That was ruthless but we slide up into 11th as if nothing happened. And here goes Bill Elliott, Ryan Newman right to the wall. Oh, no. And that's all, all kinds of flipping going on back there. And there's flipping going on in front of us. We got Petty up in the wall on his side and everybody's going to the wall. The track has been cleared out for us. We're up to fourth and we've barely even done anything. It just cleared away. Oh, we're going to have to split Cecil Gordon up the middle. Oh, and he gets kind of mini packed. We're going to get by the 19 and now we are in third. Behind BP and up there is Jimmy Means. I don't know which of those white cars he is, but he's one of them. So we got to get past BP here in this corner, preferably. There goes somebody in the wall. Ryan Newman's losing it right in front of us, though. We pack him. And here we go. It's kicking off now. We're flipping, and the wreck has left us in shambles. Our dreams of winning dashed. Our car hanging from the safer barrier. That went to hell real quick. Jeez. Seriously, we went from hero to zero so fast in that, and I've been packed again. Just driven straight through, cleaned me out, and I'm gonna get myself T-boned right here as well. Well, I think that's about all I can take for this one. Our race has just been smashed to pieces. Oh, are you kidding me? No! Oh my God, that is brilliant. That might be the best start ever. Give me that inside. I'm just gonna smack you out of the way if I got it, buddy. We're done playing games up here. Oh, a couple of guys and Ricky Rudd with the hook. Oh my God, up into the catch fence. We just got hit so hard. Why me? It's always me. The Terminators, they never stop. Oh, AJ Foyt. Had to give me with that last couple. Oh my God, watch out. There they are. I knew somebody was gonna do it, but we had to wait a minute. And I might just start my life anew right here, hanging off the safer barrier. This might just be me from now on, guys. I'll be here. Oh, watch out, clone. Watch out, wreckers in front of us. Getting up on the safer barrier, just driving along it. And somehow we squeak by. This is it. They're going to do it in this corner right here. I can see it. Here they go. Here they go. We got to go low. Go low. There they all go. They all crash and we get by and the leaders wreck it up here too. Benny Parsons. We pack our way right through up to the lead on the last lap. Oh my God. Somebody is twisted and flipping up here, but we pack our way to the lead on the last lap. The huge one breaks out and we get by that. Get through Benny Parsons and coming off of the corner. Blinking, you miss it. Our clone gets blasted. We get across the line. Somebody's getting packed next to us. What on earth just happened? That was an absolute gift from the Wreckfest gods. Everybody just got destroyed in that one crash in turn four. We cut it down to the bottom. Benny Parsons gets held up on the front stretch. We ass pack clean through him to take the dub. One of the best finishes ever. I'm calling it one of the best of all time. That was a brutal day at the races, man. Bristol gave us another classic. That was really fun. I'll be interested to see what the video reception is because playing that from where I was just now, 
was a grand old time. I will be more than happy to use these cars again. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Of course, give me all your suggestions and all that good stuff because I can always use them for future videos. And just imagine all the crazy new combinations we can come up with now that we have these cars to deal with. There's some other new skin packs that have been shared with me. And of course, these have just been shared with me privately. They are not publicly released yet. Uh, I don't know when they're planned to be publicly released, but when they are, if they are, I will be sure to tell you guys where you can get them and when they are available uh, so that everybody can enjoy them. But for now, they're only in the videos. And big thank you to Tess for sharing them with us so we can use them for the videos because uh, these things just look so awesome uh, that they're a lot of fun. And of course, when you pair them with Bristol, you know, Last World Productions, the very end creator, the very track pack. I mean, it's just a, another beautiful match made in heaven. And you know, there's all kinds of great mods and great modders out there in this community. Just hopefully we can keep adding new things and making it even better. And I'd love to be a part of it. So thank you everybody so much for watching. You know what to do. Hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. That helps me out a ton. And with that, I will see you all in the next one.